Hi, Mike Moore with Keaton Industries here to talk about how to program our timer. Specifically the timer in our Solar aeration systems, but it's essentially the same for our quiet line aeration timers as well. So use this video for that. The best time to aerate is 24 seven. That's why we set our Solar aeration systems to run for 20 hours a day and shut down from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. when the sun's at its highest in the sky to recharge those batteries without a load on the system, effectively increasing the lifespan of those batteries. Now, if you choose to run your system less than 24 hours or 20 hours with the solar aeration system, uh, the best time to aerate is at night. Naturally, diurnal oxygen fluctuations go up and down because of photosynthesis. During the day, photosynthesizing organisms create oxygen and then at night both those photosynthesizing organisms and all the other organisms in your lake or pond are consuming that oxygen so the highest oxygen concentrations are naturally right before dusk and naturally lowest right before dawn so it's best to aerate at night to try and even that out so with that information let's get to programming this timer To access the timer, you need to remove the cover from the NEMA enclosure using a uh, short Phillips head screwdriver. Unscrew the Phillips head screws that hold this in place. We've done that already, so remove that and then you have access to your timer. At this point, I recommend resetting the timer just to clear out any potential problems that exist. Once you see this is ready, move your run switch over to the time icon and we're going to program the time. We'll use the 1 through 7 button to choose the day of the week. Today is Wednesday, so we'll choose the fourth day. And now we use the H and the M buttons to program the time. and you're done. So you move the run switch back to the middle position and you see that the colon is blinking between the hours and minutes and you have your time set. To set a program cycle, the on off or the run cycle, we're gonna move the, the run switch to the P position and start programming the, uh, the on off cycle. We want this to run seven days a week, so we use the one through seven button to choose all days of the week. And this system is going to turn on, indicated by the light bulb, at 2 p.m. So we use the H to set your hours. Don't need to use the M to set your minutes because 2 p.m. sounds great. And then we will put, push the P button to set the off cycle indicated by the two, the second program in, in the program cycle. Again, we want this to be seven days a week. So we choose all seven days a week. And in this case, the off cycle is at 10 a.m because this shuts down from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. and then runs from 2 p.m. to 10 a.m. So at this point, it's optional to page through the rest of the programs. This will program up to 16 different on-off cycles, but you really only need two, the on and the off. On, indicated by the light bulb. Off, indicated by no light bulb. And the last thing you need to do is move your run switch back to the middle run position and make sure that the other switch is in the auto so it actually runs on the program. If it's in the I position, it's constantly on. If it's in the O position, it's constantly off. So make sure that both of the top switches are in the center under auto and run. And that's it. Your solar aeration system is programmed and ready to run.